3 to 4% of patients with metastatic colorectal cancer have tumors that harbor the KRAS G12C mutation. Combining a KRAS G12C inhibitor with an epidermal growth factor receptor inhibitor may be an effective strategy in these patients. A new trial examined the efficacy and safety of the KRAS G12C inhibitor Sotorasib plus the EGFR inhibitor Panitumumab in patients with metastatic colorectal cancer with mutated KRAS G12C. In this Phase 3 international open-label randomized trial, 160 adults with chemorefractory metastatic colorectal cancer with mutated KRAS G12C were assigned to either Sotorasib at a dose of 960 or 240 mg once daily plus panitumumab or to the investigator's choice of standard care with trifluoridine tipiracil or regorafenib. The primary endpoint was progression-free survival. After a median follow-up of nearly 8 months, median progression-free survival was 5.6 months in the higher-dose sotorasib panitumumab group and 3.9 months in the lower dose group, as compared with 2.2 months in the standard care group. The risk of disease progression or death was reduced by approximately 50% in the higher dose group and by approximately 40% in the lower dose group, as compared with standard care. Treatment-related adverse events of grade 3 or higher occurred in 36% of the higher dose sotorasib panitumumab group, 30% of the lower dose group, and 43% of the standard care group. The authors conclude that in patients with chemorefractory metastatic colorectal cancer with mutated KRAS G12C, combining sotorasib with panitumumab led to longer progression-free survival than standard care. Full trial results are available at nejm.org.